bow legs in children. Why are my child's legs bowed? Is this normal? Bowing of the legs can be a part of the normal physiological development of a child. The deformity has a distinctive outward curvature of the knee and lower leg. As the child becomes older, this will normally improve without treatment. The deformity is usually symmetrical and appropriate for the age of the patient. There will be no pain and no stiffness, and a normal screening process. Here's an example of the normal correction of the deformity. The infant is born with bowed legs. Bowing begins to slowly improve. At about 18 months of age, the leg becomes straight. By 3 to 4 years, the child will have a knock knee. This will correct itself by the age of 5 to 6, leaving a slight appearance of knock knee. The normal adult alignment is 5 to 7 degrees. Half of the children correct their bowing earlier, and the other half will correct it later. Observe the child, no treatment is necessary, and give it time. Pathological bowing of the legs is due to a disease process and will get worse with time if not treated. We should be concerned if the deformity is severe and if it runs in families, especially short families, or if it occurs on one side of the body. When bow leg is severe, it may result from underlying conditions such as Blount's disease. Blount's disease is a condition that can occur in toddlers as well as adolescents. Abnormality of the growth plate in the upper part of the tibia causes deformity that is often mistaken for genu varum, or bow leg. All my videos and this video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.